Street Fighter, throughout the years, has been one of the most popular fighting games of our time. The diversified group of characters and stages has made Street Fighter the inspiration for many other fighting game platforms and genres. One thing we can appreciate about Capcom and the Street Fighter design team, it's their unique eye for the character stages. These stages share the background of the character's country and its culture. It shares each country's architectural design and its art. In today's episode, the mystery behind Sagat's fighting stage, we want to share with you some of the aspects of the design and a couple of secret hints this stage has that you might not know about. Without further ado, let me welcome you to the Street Fighterverse. Sagat is an original unplayable boss character from the initial Capcom Street Fighter 1 roster. Sagat became playable in upcoming updates of the Street Fighter series. Sagat was a former member of the Shadowloo terrorist organization and personal bodyguard of Bison, originally called Shadow Law, possibly the result of mispronunciation. The Shadowloo is a very powerful and deadly criminal organization that is responsible for dealing with biochemical drugs, mind manipulation, and arms within the Street Fighter universe. Later in the series, Sagat became a good guy and changed his ways, particularly thanks to the help and training of Yoga Master Dalsum. Sagat is of tall muscular build, his height is 7 feet with 5 inches. His original gear wore purple trunks with yellow trims. He also wrapped his hands and feet. He is the fourth tallest character in the Street Fighter franchise, behind the likes of T Hawk, Hugo, and Abigail. His original design was created by the Capcom team members Takashi Nishiyama and Keiji Inafune. Sagat was the only character from the initial lineup in Street Fighter that was created by another artist. Sagat was born in Thailand, a country in which his style of fighting is very famous. Sagat is known as the Emperor of Muay Thai, in which he is master since his early stages in life. Muay Thai, sometimes referred to as Thai boxing, is a martial art and combat sport that uses stand-up striking along with various clinching techniques. This discipline known as the art of eight limbs, as it is characterized by the combined use of fists, elbow, knees, and shins. Sagat's iconic stage from the Street Fighter series is located in Thailand, in the city of Ayutthaya. The inspiration for Sagat's stage came from the Ayutthaya ruins. Thailand is a Southeast Asian country. It is known for tropical beaches, opulent royal palaces, ancient ruins, and ornate temples, displaying figures of Buddha. In Bangkok, the capital, an ultra-modern cityscape rises next to quiet canal-side communities and the iconic temples. Thai culture and traditions incorporate a great deal of influence from India, China, Cambodia, and the rest of Southeast Asia. Thailand's national religion, Theravada Buddhism, is central to modern Thai identity. Just 49 miles from the city of Bangkok, Ayutthaya is one of the oldest cities in Thailand. Also known as the Siamese Kingdom, Ayutthaya was once one of the world's largest cities. Its former glory came to a halt when the Burmese in the 18th century destroyed the city. Ayutthaya ruins in the present demonstrate a glimpse of its former glory and beauty. Set on an island at the confluence of three rivers, the archaeological site features Buddhist monasteries, temples, palaces, and statues. The area where Sagat stage is located contains the statue of a reclining Buddha. A reclining Buddha is an image that represents Buddha lying down and it is a major iconographic theme in Buddhist art. It represents the historical Buddha during his last illness. The statue of the lying Buddha in Sagat's stage is modeled after the inspiration of the Wat Lokayu Sutharam statue, located in the Ayutthaya Historical National Park in Thailand. Wat Lokayu Sutharam, also known as Franun, it is assumed that it was built in the middle of the Ayutthaya period in the reign of King Samchao Faraya around 1995. This temple has the largest reclining Buddha image in the island of Ayutthaya. Franun is enshrined in an outdoor brick building with a length of 42 meters and 8 meters high. There are lotus lobes supporting the head instead of the crown. Franun was originally a Buddha image. In the year 2499, there are 24 octagonal brick pillars, all of which originally would have been built to cover the reclining Buddha statue. During the beginnings of Street Fighter II, Sagat used the ancient ruins of the Ayutthaya for assassin and spiritual training. 
Sasan is a meditative discipline that is typically the primary practice of the Zen Buddhist tradition. The meaning and method of Sasan varies from school to school, but in general, it can be regarded as means of insight into the nature of existence. In Street Fighter World Warrior, the statue appears white with a palm tree decorating the area. In the Champion Edition, they recolored the statue into a bronze tone, and the palm tree in the foreground was eliminated. In Super Street Fighter, the statue remains with the bronze color, but the background setting reveals a much more detailed landscape of the Ayutthaya ruins over a red sunset. In Street Fighter Alpha, Warrior's Room, Sagat's stage looks from a different perspective. The sleeping Buddha's feet seem to be facing forward, with his head at the other end. In the Street Fighter Alpha 2, the statue looks bigger, with its face facing forward, and has a different angle than from the previous games. Sagat's stage contains pillars scattered from the Ayutthaya ruins. In Street Fighter Alpha 3, the stage also dictates a sleeping Buddha in its background, with its face more inclined to the middle of the stage. In Street Fighter V, the stage is renamed as the King's Court, which retains most of the characteristics of the previous Street Fighter games. The Ayutthaya ruins is one of the most popular Street Fighter stages for a reason. It's inspiring and beautiful to see. By its structural complexity and its creation, we can be submerged in Thailand's culture and heritage. In this episode, we have talked about Sagat's stage origins. We have talked about Ahuaya ruins, the history of this ancient Siamese kingdom. We have also talked about the architectural design of the Phranun itself and the inspiration behind Sagat's stage. So what's your favorite Street Fighter stage? What did you like most about the Ayutthaya ruins? Let us know in the comment section down below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay up to date with new theories and info. Thank you for watching. This has been your Street Fighter host. Welcome to the center stage. Discord server. There you can talk with us, chat about current events going on in Street Fighter, information, theories, and lore. We'll leave the link in the description box below. We want to thank everyone for tuning in and becoming part of the Street Fighter community. We want to thank you for your positive comments towards our channel because it only habilitates us to grow even more. From the Street Fighterverse crew, we thank you.